Agricultural producers in Australia and all over the world have been exposed to some of the most challenging conditions in history. Growers are facing unprecedented production costs and increased consumer demand. The University of Queensland's Professor Robert Henry and his team are working with BGI Group to harness the power of genomics. They're hoping their research into the humble macadamia plant will find solutions that can really help growers. My research focuses on plants of social and economic importance, and I'm especially interested in capturing more biodiversity to support both food and energy security, and to better conserve those genetic resources for future generations. Genomics is really looking at all of the genes in an organism, so it's the total picture, it's the complete blueprint of the organism. Genomics is really the key tool we have of understanding our biodiversity at the level we need to understand it. Together, Professor Henry and the BGI group are using genomic sequencing technologies with macadamias to help growers. When we plant a macadamia tree as a young seedling, it takes maybe eight years before it starts to produce a crop and many more years before it's producing an economic yield of nuts. That uh, period of time, of course, is, is lost production time. What we're aiming to do here is have trees that produce an economic yield in just a few years, providing an enormous economic benefit to people in the industry. Studying macadamias is going to teach us a lot that's going to have much wider application in agriculture. Speed, volume and accuracy of data are vital to researchers' success. BGI Group is challenging the possibilities of genomics with the quality and delivery of their data. Quite often in plant breeding we're looking for that one in a million. And we've got to look at those million plants, analyse them and sometimes collect a lot of information about each one of them before we find that just that one that's got the combination of characteristics that really will succeed and be a productive plant in an agricultural and food production sense. Working with BGI Group, we've been able to produce the data that we need to support the genomics in a very cost-efficient way, getting the large quantities of high-quality data that we need to support the whole genomics program. Professor Henry's research uses BGI Group sequencing technology with macadamias, not only to preserve rare varieties, but also make plants more sustainable and economically viable. The objectives uh, for the macadamia program will be certainly better varieties faster, much smaller trees that can be planted more closely together to allow much more sustainable, intensified production. It minimises the use of land and water, and it's been very pleasing, I think, to see BGI Group involved in providing these types of services to create and enhance the, the competitive landscape that ensures researchers have access internationally. Professor Henry hopes the success of his research using genomics with macadamias can inspire research across all plant life globally. We see many opportunities for quite radical improvement of our current crops and we will need to do that in the future with the climate change and uh, growing populations, we need some big step changes and that's what genomics offers the potential to deliver. The ultimate is that we look at the genomic sequence of every organism on the planet. The sort of dream that genomics people have today, that we're going to look at everything, that we will capture all of life 